How do you make sort of an economic case, a financial case for pursuing these things and sort of maybe move it beyond just some of the, uh, I guess, uh, moral questions and, and moral solutions that people have been talking about mainly? Certainly. Well, well, in, in, in that instance, there's actually quantifiable and verifiable data that proves out uh, the diversity business case. So uh, we've assessed and measured a countless number of organizations. We found that uh, those organizations that are more diverse and inclusive have a 33% greater impact on the overall profitability within the organization. Additionally, uh, those organizations that are more diverse uh, have about a 70% improvement in overall retention uh, rates within their organization. So the more diverse an organization is, not only has a business impact in terms of profitability, but it also has a very much an impact in terms of the ability to attract uh, and retain top talent within these organizations. Mm -hmm. And that's oftentimes the data and the specifics that we point to, which takes a lot of the emotions out and quite frankly just proves that it does make good, sound economic and business sense, not to mention, of course, it's the right thing to do for society overall. It's a win-win, clearly, Bradley. I'm interested in, have you been surprised by the turnover that we've seen at the top in I mean, Apple? We've seen lose its chief of diversity. We've seen companies be exiting across the board, McDonald's being another one. I mean, are you getting called up a lot more to replace positions of diversity and heads of diversity of businesses? And does it need to also not just be heads of diversity, but CEOs, CFOs, CMOs, all executive levels? Yeah. So they can't speak necessarily to those specific instances of those companies that you did mention, but we are uh, getting uh, quite a bit of calls, not only in terms of how can we think about diversifying our organizations, not only for the C-suite levels, C-suite levels that you mentioned, but also, of course, across boards of directors and other parts of the organizations. And so we are certainly seeing a lot of that. Uh, in terms of the, the turnover that's happening, um, again, something that we can't necessarily comment on, but we are working quite closely with these organizations to make sure that they have the top talent because it is important to have an organization that is representative uh, of the people and the customers that they do serve.